Alright everyone, it is me, Johnson Chan, and hopefully everyone had a good uh, weekend. So, uh, still having trouble sleeping, uh, I got like five hours of sleep last night, no, make it five or s five and a half to six. Problem is, I have all those, pl I have plenty of whatever, so, you know, if I wants to sleep more, I should be able to, but, you know, it's just like, ah, we're just not tired, and like, I'm still trying to figure out why that is. Like yesterday, I actually made a change, and I wound up not taking any naps, so I thought that would help. Uh, so, I don't know. We'll see if I can do it again today, because I figure out the only reason I take a nap is because I, I eat too much food. But yesterday, I just limited my calorie intake to just 600 calories in the first meal, and then I pushed the rest of my calories later on, so I spread it out more. So, uh, yeah, to avoid, because like, cause you always get tired when you eat, uh, when you eat. Right, or rather, you eat too much. So for me, it looks like 600 calories is a good spot. Enough to not only get rid of the hunger pangs, but also just make me not hungry for a little while. You know, like you know, a couple hours or something. So anyway, I didn't uh, I didn't do the full research. It's like this thing's not working. Uh, but I did a little bit. So we'll just go through an hour and I have some pre-opened articles. Uh, so Bitcoin search interest. For last week, crater to 10, so as usual, nothing big's happening, which doesn't surprise me because the prices here are horrible. Um, this is not correct. It should be refreshing. Oh, oh, oh wow, it did crash $100. What the hell? It was like it was like 9100 bucks just like a short while ago. So Bitcoin, well, dominance is at 64.8%, uh, 24 hour volume is really bad at 55 billion. So literally no one's doing anything. Bitcoin's at 9,045, basically. Litecoin's at 41.34. This is the shitty part. This now I'm going to be forced to sell my Litecoin. At least the instead of keeping it for the IRS, but now I just sell it for fiat. And like this is just such a shitty amount of money. Uh, Dogecoin, coin, um, 288.2 million. So, see, even if I did fully get my back all my mining uh, shit back up and running, like even if I make a hundred bucks a day, it doesn't really feel that great. You know, it's like, uh, you know, can't really do much with it. I mean, it does cover the expenses, but you know, I want to be thriving. You know, like big time, not like you know, kind of surviving. Uh, but for the most part, you know, that's just how it goes. This fucking coronavirus bullshit really. Uh, it was really something. But it'll eventually come. So at home workers have yet to return to their workplace. Yeah, I mean here's the thing. People love working at home. It's like, you know, no more trains, no more commute, no more wasted time, no more having to get dressed. Yeah, work at home is the best. Like I'm kinda of surprised where people don't do it. So this work at home thing is here to stay. So that's definitely gonna have like big impact changes on um, really our entire society. Uh, in fact, it'll actually probably reduce global warming if for those fucking global global warming nut jobs, right? Because you know, less cars, less carbon dioxide. So it'll actually be interesting to see what kind of impact that has on that industry, on the car industry too. It's gonna, it's gonna impact a lot of things. Cause there'll just be less people out out and about. Uh, Downs, right? Actually, let's refresh this. Uh, make sure we get the okay. Um, <clears throat> At home, workers have yet to. Uh, Dow rises as investors. I all right. So this coronavirus stuff is actually actually I already have that open. This coronavirus stuff is actually bullshit. Um, I mean, the virus itself is real, but like the rise in infections is bullshit, right? Because what's happening is they're increasing testing and they're finding out who's actually infected and who's not. That's what that's all that it means. But they're trying to pass it off as oh the thing's resurging. It's not resurging. It's going backwards like it's supposed to. Right, because it was resurging. Why isn't New York City, you know, locking back down again? You know, like they can't do it, right? You know, so, uh, so that would explain why the markets are not tanking as much as I thought it was. Because again, it's like ah, it, it was all bullshit. So that that that's what's going on. And of course, the one website that's actually talking about that has been banned literally off the internet. And I'm not referring to Alex Jones. So. Uh, here's something about China's gonna get strong. China's gonna get stronger no matter what. You know, we have a very high based IQ, right? Us Chinese people. And number two, we're not politically correct, unlike here in America, where everyone's got their balls chopped off. Though I think that's actually starting to finally fade away. So that's actually good. So, uh, so as long as white people, you know, rise up 
against their fucking anti-white oppressors. You know, I think uh, things should be fine. Uh, Reynolds doing all right, and don't worry about the other stocks because I know they're not going to go bankrupt. Actually, I have curious. What is RF at? Oh, wow, it's actually going up. That's at ten dollars eighty-one cents. So it's going to be a lot. Second wave may be even worse because people. Okay, so it's just fake news terrorism. So basically, between rioting, race wars, and coronavirus, you know, they're just going to the global search could keep rotating between all that just to keep fucking Trump over. Uh, I did I already looked at Scott Adams. He didn't have anything uh, new to really say. And of course, he's talking about black vote going up 50% or whatever. Uh, I actually just cannot understand uh, any of these. But I think... <clears throat> Rasmussen Daily, black likely voters, total approval. Okay, so it actually is going up. So basically, blacks actually did not like the rioting. Well, but I mean, if you still look at the overall numbers, it's still like 25%. So this is the reason why you don't pander to minorities. Look, even if Trump does the right thing, he's only going to get 25% of the fucking black vote at best, maybe 30 or 35. Meanwhile, he's losing all the white votes, which is, has way more people. It's like, it, it's retarded. So, you know, but whatever. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, before we move on forward, uh, I don't see anything new here. Uh... Actually, maybe I actually do want to open this article. This actually was talked about the lockdown. I thought this was going to be more presidential shit. Yeah, so, uh, JFC coin, as usual, 7 to 8. Uh, we're still targeting like the beginning of July for the swap. I haven't heard anything from Mitch yet, but that's because he's still working on Rick's coin. So, um, there's that. Uh, 404 coins at 346 to 368. Nothing new there. Two by two coin, uh, 68 to 69. Actually, you know what? Let me. Uh, let's see. Uh, 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 July 6th. <sighs> okay, all right, there we go. Uh, two by two, uh, yeah, it does look like it's permanently at upper 60s to lower 70s because <clears throat> the, you know, max supply in two by two is, you know, still whatever. Uh, let's see. Uh, So, yeah, um, but I mean, given how shitty the economy is still doing and then like the uncertainty around Trump, like, uh, it's going to be a while before we can, I mean, even if I get my tower defense game out, I mean, no one's going to really put in any money for it. And I, in fact, I don't think I'm going to put it on the web. I'm just going to put it on the mobile store and then on Steam and then that's it. <clears throat> I mean, I'm not sure if there's an application. Let's see. Game submit fee Google Play Apple uh, iOS store is it? Uh, okay, so Google Play is twenty five dollars. That's actually pretty cheap. Uh, Steam charges a a uh, hundred dollars. Um, an app on iOS. For iOS, the iOS stores charges a fee of ninety nine dollars a year. Google Play is a one time twenty five. The cost of doing so on Windows is much cheaper than the others. Is charged or uh, Windows? Why do they talk about Windows? You mean a Microsoft Windows Store? Does, that, does anyone even use that? <coughs> Alright, so Apple, so wait, so Apple is it per app? Uh, yeah, wow, $99 per app per year. I mean, that's still pretty cheap, but uh windows 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 okay we're gonna have to do this 
Uh, Ashley Beck Progar Analyst. How reliable is this info? Two answers. Uh, Alright, Google Plus and one time fee of 25. What does she mean by. Uh, I'm gonna assume she means the Microsoft Windows Store. $12. Well, I, I don't give a shit about that. No one uses that. Alright, so it's gonna. Oh my god, to publish my game on all three platforms is gonna cost me $125, $225 right out of the gate just for my fucking tower defense game. So believe it or not, I probably will publish to just Android and Steam then. Maybe I can look at uh, Apple iOS later. Stock market news, live updates. Oh no, hold on, we're not done here. Uh, oh, and then Rick's 193.1. It's already going down a little bit, so not too bad, not too bad. Um, let's see. Uh, thank you to the one person that subscribed. Actually, I think I did this last time, didn't I? Oh well, just in case. 196, thank you to that one person. PayPal deal won't drive Bitcoin price higher. Uh, no, not by itself, but the cumulative total effect over the years of everyone jumping in on Bitcoin, then the answer is yes. Uh, top basis gold may see you out. Uh, fuck you, gold. Bitcoin is not dead. Get yours at uh, perfect storm. Uh, Bitcoin was price flip. No, I have another temptation to get some more uh, Burger King today. Uh, that is a very nice thumbnail, so we're going to use that for thumbnail. I'm going to do this. Uh, uh, Notorious Bitcoin Will says new crypto, fairy tale, fully. No. Mm, little known crypto. No. Central bank, digital current could be the next step in evolution. Money. Uh, we kind of already know about this. We have been covering it. Uh, not recently, though. But I don't really feel like reading this, but yeah, I mean, it's definitely going to be a big boom for all of us. Whale thieves are now mixing stick no. Uh, Roaring tort no. Uh, rise to 396k, how long it could take? No. I do, have, I do well admit, Daily Hole really does have really good thumbnails. Uh, China's first, big, first blockchain based bidding system launches. Okay, so they're already ahead in the blockchain. See, China's already embraced blockchain while America's still jerking off about it, you know, because, you know, we're busy. We're busy blowing up statues like uh, like ISIS and then fucking, you know, burning down American cities. That's basically what we're doing in America while China's building the fucking actual fucking future. Uh, at least the good news is at least it seems like people have stopped fucking bitching about China, though. Because, like... It's like, you know, again, is China ordering the destruction of our statues? Is China ordering the black people in America to vote Democrats? Is China fucking, uh, you know, ordering people to stay locked in, uh, locked in their homes like in the cages like animals, right? Is China ordering fucking, uh, you know, all this mass shit and the riots and burning down the cities and all of that stuff, right? I don't know. I've yet to see any evidence of that, you know, so... Uh, Mike McGlow, and again, you know, it's just a cheap trick to just fool people and distract people. But luckily, luckily, I think most people are smart enough to not see it. Obviously, not everybody, right? In fact, I think, I think a lot of Republicans, you know, they may not like China and Chinese people. Like, they begin to realize, like, wait a minute, yeah, like, I may not like Chinese people, but, you know, the, the guy that's robbing my house ain't Chinese. The fucking people burning my shit down ain't Chinese. Like, what the fuck's going on? <laughs> yeah, so... So the cognitive dissonance that has to give way to the truth at some point. Oh, fuck you. I'm not even going to look at that. I'm so fucking sick and tired of seeing this BLM shit. All right, so let's see. How badly is Trump doing on predicted? No, I don't even say how well. Now it's just badly. Jesus Christ. He is 24% down. I have to double check my math. 24 plus 38 is 62. Holy shit. He is down 24% against Joe Biden. Now the now the hit in Trump vote is going to need to be uh, 13, 12% to tie and 13% to win. Uh, it's getting to the point where it's getting way too much. It's getting way too much. Uh, okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, he is attacking Joe Biden. So, I mean, I'm not even... I mean, right now he's already going pretty ham on the... Uh, uh, I'm attacking Joe Biden. Let's take it. Proudly for your dad. 
first African American state senator in the state of in the state of Delaware. Everything about. I hope that music doesn't cause problems. And by the way, you know, I sit on the stand, and it get hot. I got a lot of. I got hairy legs. The only reason why I did that is because of the fucking shitty music in the background. That turn. That 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 turn. Uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun, and the kids used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down, so it was straight, and then watch the hair come back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about. This is actually this is back. actually pretty good, actually. And I love kids jumping. Up. Yeah, he's actually trying to portray him both as disgusting, weird, and just mentally not there. Not my life. Proud. Yeah, this is actually this is actually good. Uh, will it work? I, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. Private property. Oh, that's not good. Uh, uh, what are they talking about? Self-defense. See, they're trying to take away people's self-defense. All right, uh, United States Park Police, uh, tough to identify. All right, this is good. Uh, sure. Uh, attempt to. Oh my God, can... what's interesting is he's just put this all in separate shit. All right. Uh, I don't know which one of these idiots looks. Hmm. Now let's go with the fat white dude. There we go. Cause I'm not gonna read. I'm not gonna retweet all that. It's just just these two. All right. So he's going. Oh, I didn't see this one. This would have been good too. The fat, the fat uh, liberal whale lady. Yeah, that could work too. Well, I already did my two tweets. Uh, oh man, this was even better. You know what? We're going to put that at the top and undo this one. Actually, what is this? Is anyone even going to read this shit? <sighs> Alright, that's enough for me. So support a very powerful tid your sins on those that have analyzed my side and maybe we are all regard and we can really stop. Thank you. Oh, really? Did I, is that actually true? Uh, Joe Biden, running for hell, he's a lot of stuff, so they're going to fix these terrorists. He really should call them, you know, a couple, couple point of guns that probably say that as a group march tour, the mayor's home to demand her resignation. Oh, this is actually, oh, this is actually a real thing. Um, oh man. You know, this might actually, uh, uh, <laughs> Oh wow, is that a, I think that's a full M16. A couple point guns that probably are mayor's home. I think this is the mayor? Uh, okay. Uh, really, you're, you're gonna fuck it. Jeez. Uh, All right. Well, Trump's trying, so that's good. Um, is it enough? Uh, I don't know. So far, not. not no. Oh, this is really co good too. Uh, okay. So we're not gonna use that for a thumbnail. This will be a good thumbnail. What is this? But eBay to establish crypto stocks. All right. So let's see. All right, uh, uh, see, the only reason why I'm having... God, no wonder my fucking shit's lagging. All these fucking autoplay F-word shit uh, asshole articles on Yahoo. Stock market news live updates. Oh, yeah, when I play Elite Dangerous, I constantly have to go to, like, the wiki there, and they always autoplay the introduction of the spaceships. Like, all right, I know what the spaceships do. I don't need to fucking autoplay the stupid YouTube video for it. It's so aggravating. Excuse me. Stock market news, live updates, SCD, 
All right, uh, let's see. Okay, well, we already established this because it's all fake news, terrorist bullshit. All right, we're just doing more testing, so we're finding out who actually has coronavirus and who doesn't. That's all that it is. It's not an increase in the infection rate, especially because it's fucking summer. So, you know, notice how they all of a sudden didn't seem to mention, hey, it's summer, it's hot out, like, you know, the virus is doing better. No, because it'll fucking help Trump, so of course they're not going to say that. Uh, Sydney. Uh, more cities are ro uh, rolling back the reopening plans over the weekend. Of course, California. I'm going to reclose in Southern County, including Los Angeles. Uh, we said more forecasters. Blah blah. blah. Uh, everything counts as coronavirus. Just last year, I showed my to the TV of more unemployment, and then that's the end of that. Uh, New York City lockdown. Let me see. Are we, we uh, June 11th? Cautiously start. Uh, it begins to end its life. I wonder if I can end mine. Uh, that's from Vogue. Garcia, uh, photos of Detroit, New York, and lockdown. Uh, of enter a new. No, okay. Actually, this is a pretty good article. Yeah, I want to read this off, off stream. Off uh, stream. Uh, okay, we're not going to, all right, uh, this is not quite a while, I'm, I'm going to read this off stream if I have time. Uh, but what I'm looking for, because I don't see any, I don't see anything that says we're rolling it back. This is, we're seeing old ones. Okay, so we are in phase two. Um, okay, so we're in phase two, so it looks, and this was June 22nd. Okay, we're gonna have to use search tools for this. Uh, past week. Okay. Cuomo Twitter. We're gonna go on this guy's thing. Uh. Talking about Pride Month, and uh, he's telling everyone to, to do a mask. Uh, okay, yeah, we're definitely doing a phase reopening. So we're actually, wow, this is actually really good. Uh, oh, in terms of improvements in the situation, obviously it's not good that five people died from this shit, but uh, we kind of know that, you know, if you just happen to have coronavirus along with something else, you know, they'll count the coronavirus stuff. Uh, hardly any today. Americans have made sweet speeches changes their work, spending, investing, and finance has teamed up with Harris polling conducted from June 15 to 17. 54 percent of our clients say they're currently working from home because of coronavirus. 40 percent working from home full time. 30 percent doing so part time. 32 percent say they're working at their normal work with no chain routine. Only 4 percent of those who began working from home because of the virus have returned to their normal work sites. <clears throat> really, district deep disruptions. Blah blah. <clears throat> Oh man, you know what that means? I'm never gonna see my halal carts in my neighborhood ever again, because there's gonna be less people now. They still haven't come back yet. Hire, you know what? I want I want uh, Burger King today, so you know, because I really just want to get out and get some air. Higher paid, blah 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 blah. Sixty percent, okay. Sixty percent of college grads say they are working at full uh, home because of virus. Twenty six percent, okay. About workers who earn 100k or more, 52% are working from home compared to 26% uh, were earning less than 50k, which makes sense because if you're making this much out of salary, chances are you're doing like a high tech, high high money volume thing. So either you can afford to hire, like pay a illegal immigrant to do your outsourced things, uh, was it like like Task Rabbit or something? Or, you know, you're, it's high tech, so everything's on the internet anyway, so you just work from home. <clears throat> a thin majority of at-home work prefer the change with, wait, a thin majority of at-home work prefer the change. 51 say it's better than going to the workplace. 30% say it's worse, with 90% saying it's about the same. Wow, so 30%, oh, wow. So we combine the, the same with the 51% that want to work at home. We're looking at 70, per, that is a 70, wow. 70% of people just will not really prefer to, will not be going back to workplace. 
Uh, because the current three percent jurors so say, oh wow, three percent say it's permanent, seven percent say it's temporary. Really? This is a this is a lot. This is actually really good. That means the job loss is actually significantly less uh, damaging than in, than on paper. Sixty percent say they're working fewer hours. Sixty percent say they're working more hours. One percent about deep recession, temporary. Could, uh, oh, the job loss, the temporary job could be permanent. Yes, Congress deserves that. Income and spending is down. Ga, 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 ga. Yeah, because I know everywhere I go, there are sales everywhere. There is just sales everywhere. And I st I'm still not buying. In fact, um, uh, what Steam, Steam has their usual summer sale. The only thing I bought was uh, Elite uh, Dangerous Horizons, the expansion pack. That, that's why I've been playing it so much because uh, there's something called engineers in the game, and then fucking they they, they 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 allow you to modify your base modules, and like it turn it really changes the game. Like you, you, now my ship is like just getting jacked up like crazy. And there's like so much more room for improvement, so I'm gonna be spending like at least a couple of weeks like grinding the reputation and flying around the galaxy and shit to upgrade my ship. All right, uh, Burger King sales rebound, states to reopen after coronavirus. So the, the real reason I'm reading this, well, yes, because I want Burger King, but also because uh, the states reopening part uh, and their sales are rebounding. Life after quarantine for many people, because of Burger King, Whopper Fry, you know, uh, See, so, uh, they rally back at Burger King. Burger King. Do, do they have what's the they they used to put the stock symbol for for like whatever company you're looking at on Yahoo Finance? They don't do that anymore, and now it's like a pain in the ass. Like they even list fucking McDonald's, right? But no fucking Burger King. I don't know who would I have more faith in, Burger King or McDonald's? Let's see. I mean, Wendy's. I actually like Wendy's better. Uh, ex dividend date. They have a yield of 2.74%, and they're worth a shit load of money. Burger King. Uh, oh, because they're private. Wendy's? Uh, Wendy's is pretty cheap. But their presence is very small. That's the only problem. They also pay a shittier dividend. I guess that's technically okay. Uh, oh, I guess if I went to fast food joint, I could just get Wendy's stock, right? Or I could pay nine times the amount of money and buy one share of McDonald's. Hmm. Oh, but I guess I could go with either. Um, okay, restaurant brands joins a meanwhile restaurant brand, Popeyes brand. Uh, uh, blah, 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 mid March. Uh, Tim Hortons is climbing back from more early. Okay, so people are so people are going back to eating, so that's good. Um, yeah. Okay. Then here's Olive Garden. Okay. So basically, everyone's recovering, so that's good. I don't see any real mention of other states, but this is good. You know, that means things are improving. It's just not as fast as I'd like. And then we're gonna end today's video on this one. eBay and Swash Crypto Exchange mining farms after going public, uh, which reportedly listed on the Nasdaq long later is playing express business beside the cryptocurrency exchange mining farms held by eBay representative. Uh, so eBay is going to do crypto trading exchange and they're also going to sell mining power. Uh, they are based in China, of course. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, it's the most important for the Okay, oh wow. Good. What 25 million IPO is about to start? Uh, eBay is expecting to list on NASDAQ global market on the ticker e bond later today on June 16th. Oh shit, this is an old article. Hey, wait a minute. So remember, remember I was looking for a public stock to be able to buy uh, put options for Bitcoin and cryptocurrency? Looks like we've got a winner in uh, e bond. Now I know why God showed me this. Uh, this uh, this article. I also did the wrong one. Uh, oh wow, the markets are up strongly. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, Ebon. Oh, Eben. Huh, Ebon. Like the e the, the Eben hand. Ebang International Holdings. It's already down. Um, hmm. 
All right, so we're definitely gonna. I am actually going to. Yeah. All right. Very good. Very good. So this is all right. So we're gonna use this stock for the time being. They're based in China, so at least I know it'll it'll be run it'll be run well and it'll be run uh, efficiently. And more importantly, they're doing a bunch of other shit. What else is eBang doing? Uh, let's see, cloud mining, crypto exchange. What? But what's their base thing that they do? Because it says it's expanding its business, but what does it normally do? Uh, okay, they're also, okay, so they have the infinite game mindset, so they're going to do blockchain tech into financial services, education, and healthcare. So these are very good. So, so believe it or not, the education industry is actually a really big uh, industry. It's not even a niche, it's an industry. For some reason, it makes that gurgling sound on my sink at random, I don't know why. Luckily, nothing comes out on my sink, but... All right, getting listed, and NASDAQ, blah, blah, blah. All right, so these guys are definitely a watcher. So not only do we get a kick-ass thumbnail picture, but yeah, now we actually have a way to short the Bitcoin markets when it comes time to do so. Let's hope these guys can do it because because they'll, they'll let you get big or also diversified. So that allows them to get bigger, too. So, you know, because uh, when you have something that's very specialized, like gold and silver or even cryptocurrency, uh, you know, it, 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 you don't have flexibility, you know, and you know, my investment in play style. I like having flexibility, you know. I min max, and then I go a couple steps below min maxing. So you know that's where the flexibility comes in. So I get like very powerful, close to the best, but not the best, right? Because there's a danger when you go for the top, right? Because you're at the top, everyone guns for you, right? That's what Donald Trump. That's what Donald Trump would always say in his books. So anyway, if you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, or the subscribe button from where you're watching this from, or on my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash GMC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right-hand side of this page to so continue uh, growing this channel. All right, I'm going to go get my Burger King. I'm also supposed to shave my head today. I don't know what I'm going to do. I, know I also want to keep playing more Elite Dangerous. And I have to actually work on my game today because I spent like three days just not working on it at all as a like rest period. So uh, I'm going to have a nice little busy day. In the meantime, I can uh, see here's the thing. The fucking markets are up. Why is the fucking crypto not going up? Let's take one last look. And of course, everyone just wants to be a fucking asshole. Well, that's just how it goes. So I, don't know, I guess I'll just sell my fiat in July or August or I'll try to hold out a couple, another couple months. Uh, maybe it'll work. Maybe it won't. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and always remember, Johnson Chan, JMC Coin, 404 Coin. Um, I do want to do something on Parlor actually, but uh, I'll have to do the screenshots for it. So here's our thumbnail, and there we go.